Our proposal to combat modern day slavery with technology begins with the online shopping experience, in this case with Amazon.com, which we chose as our starting point for its massive share in the online retail market with annual sales of more than $30 billion. We have installed a prototype of our intervention tool, a browser extension, which we call Abala Shop. You can see the extension, which I have installed on my computer, in the address bar. However, what we have now is not a finished product, but a cornerstone on which to build. Abala Shop's goal is to make information available about the goods online consumers are buying. We believe that consumers will choose the ethical option over the unethical when the information is adequately provided. To do this, we provide accessible, easy to comprehend information about the slavery impact of each item that the consumer considers buying. To show how Abala Shop works, we'll emulate a typical consumer adding items to their shopping cart. Say we're looking for outdoor clothing, and hiking shoes, and a laptop. With these items in my shopping cart, I would normally proceed to check out, but now it's time to bring in a Bala Shop to make a more informed purchase. A Bala Shop takes the information given in your shopping cart and displays this information next to the item's free-to-work grade. Free-to-work, a project of not for sale, provides ratings of various industries, primarily apparel, chocolate, and electronics to show which companies are making efforts to keep clean their supply chains of child and forced labor. Displaying these grades quickly and simply is important. We want both an informed and unencumbered consumer. We think Abala Shop provides both. We maintain a database of all the free-to-work grades, which are made public by Not For Sale, and cross-check the items in the cart with this database. We now continue our shopping to further demonstrate the power of Abala Shop. We've added these new items that you can see here in our cart. You'll see now the variety of industries and brands able to be kept in check by the rating system and its easy visibility through Abala Shop. Notice the items in the cart span almost the full spectrum of grades, in this case from A- all the way down to F. The reason for this is that the user is able to set their own standard for what is up to par. Here at the bottom, the user may set a minimum acceptable grade for the cart. As the user chooses a preferred grade, the list updates immediately, and the extension will remember this minimum standard until the user restarts the browser. So here, when I choose B, B plus and above will no longer be visible. Similarly, if I select D, all grades above the mark vanish. We've designed an algorithm that shows the consumer what alternatives to each item are available based on that item's industry, attributes, and grade. After considering these options, we decided to remove this candy from the cart in favor of another bar from Frontier, which has a better grade. It's with simple changes like this that consumers make a big impact. We've walked you through how Ball Shop works in its current state, but there are many improvements we plan for the future before we will consider it a finished product. In its current state, this application only works for Google Chrome in conjunction with an Amazon shopping cart. However, this project has enormous potential for growth. We intend to make the extension compatible with other browsers and other online shopping sites. In addition, we intend to increase the ratings database, either through a partnership with Not For Sale or the creation and expansion of our own database. Finally, we plan to add support for multiple languages, increasing the applicability and impact of our extension around the world. That's all from us here with Abala Shop. We're convinced of the power of each and every dollar spent on a more ethical purchase. It's with these small steps that large movements against trafficking will occur. We look forward to fighting together against the spread of human trafficking worldwide.